What's up guys, Craig here from OTB Game, bringing you a new video on the channel. And today's video is different to what I would usually do. Today's video I'm doing because I'm being asked questions of what is fart, what is champs, why do you do the challenge, why only 11 wins? And I will explain all that in this video. So Ultimate Team is a game mode within FIFA where players try to build their best teams um, by earning coins, which you can play on packs, you can buy players, you can, yes you can use cash, which to me I'm totally against it. At the start of the game I can understand why people put it in and don't get me wrong I put a little bit in. Packed absolutely no one so totally not worth it. Um, but you really, these videos are to show that you really don't need to do that. If you grind out the game, if you play enough champs, if you play enough rivals, you will pack players, you will earn coins. And yeah at the end of the day it's all about luck because that's what the packs are. But I can't stress enough there is no need to spend lots of money on on this game yeah there's lots of videos out there that will say oh i packed this and i spent this money it doesn't mean you're gonna there's plenty of other videos out there they spend hundreds of pounds and they pack absolutely no one let's just take take that in mind because it is a game at the end of the day and and when october comes around the game resets and you lose any investment you put into that game champs is a weekend mode on fifa where it's probably the most competitive game mode on fifa where people will use these teams you get 20 games to get as many wins as you can and within those 20 wins there's certain ranks um, which are represented by a number of points based on wins where you get four points and you get a point for a loss and these range um, from zero to um, 19 wins and to be honest the teams I'm going to use in this they're not really going to touch 16 wins these teams are your, your elite you're really like your pros, these are teams with Mbappe, Kimpembe, those are what you call the meta players. And to be honest, those that are pushing those higher end of likeness spent quite a lot of money on the game. And there's nothing, nothing against that. That's fine if that's what they want to do. But at the end of the day, it's a game. So you shouldn't be put out to try and get 16. And if you get 11, 14, 9, it's not the end of the world. And it's a game at the end of the day. So my challenge, personally... I like to pull and use different players. So if you look at my channel already, there's highlight videos on there. I've used a full Danish team. I've used a Chinese league team. I've even used a full token team. And the, behind that, the reason behind this is because I just like to use different players. I don't like to use the same players every week or add one different player into my team every week. I want to be tested and I want to enjoy it for a game. So that then brings me to how many wins I go for. So in previously, I just tried to go as many wins as I can. But... After looking at what the rewards really are, like I said, 16 wins is probably out of reach for these teams. So then the next one down is 14, the next one down is 11. So for me, 11 is a good target. And the reason behind this, and it's not just for me, this is for you out there, is with 11 wins, you will get reds and you will get three of them. And these reds give you basically, a, they're a player pick where you'll get a player from that current team of the week. You'll also then get a team of the week pack, which is tradable, which you can sell for coins or you can just uh, discard and get coins for so but if you were to get 14 wins those two rewards are the exact same whether you get 11 or 14 the only difference between the rankings is you get a one slightly better pack which is just luck at the end of the day and then you get slightly more coins which really they don't really mean much because the coin difference isn't there and i can't stress this enough whether you get three reds from getting 16 wins or if you get two reds from nine wins, the luck, they're not weighted. The luck is exactly the same. You could pull the best player from like nine wins and someone, believe me, I've got 16 a couple of times. The, the luck is just no different. So then the content of the videos, you'll see there'll be highlights and there will be me aiming to get the 11 wins. And if you join me on my stream, and I will mention it in the video, I will play all 20 games with the team that I use. And if you wonder, oh, did he manage to get more wins? That will be shown in the videos, as well as my reds, because I know everyone likes to see what people get from their reds. So, guys, I can't stress enough. If you've got any ideas for uh, teams that you want me to use, whether they're hybrids, whether they're um, past and present, different nations, I don't know, based on the tallest team, just drop them in the comments. Um, if you like what I'm doing, smash that like button. Don't forget to subscribe and hit that bell to be notified when all my videos go live. And if you like my content and you want to see it live, I stream over on Facebook Gaming, links in the description below. And guys, the most important thing, as I always say, greatness is what we're on the brink of, and I will catch you in the next one. Bye.